Hello. So today we're looking at early samurai, 200 to 1500 AD, part of the Osprey military elite series. This book is originally from 1991, and that's the copy that I have here. I've been a fan of Japanese culture for many years. So the part that I like about these books are all of the historic images that they have in here of the armor of a uh, reconstructed village. Here, let me sit down so that I don't have my shadow going across this. The helmets. You could say that the text about the Buddhist revolution and that sort of thing can be found online in a variety of historical websites, but it's the images in these kinds of books that appeal to me more because um, some of these are from private collections, so there aren't pictures of them available on the web. Some of them are from museums who don't have their entire collections digitized. So I find these images of the armor uh, very useful as uh, illustrations of what the different swords look like at different time periods. And, you know, clearly this is a <laughs> reproduction, but they did a good job of making sure that the armor was fairly accurate. You know, this beautiful piece here. So I really appreciate the images. It would be nice if they were all in color. But these books were trying to be reasonably affordable, and if they made the whole book in color, then it would not have been as inexpensive. So there is that thing to know, but you can still see a lot of the detail of how the helmets were constructed, how the armor was put together, you know, and it talks about a glossary of terms. And, you know, as much as this stuff is available on the web, sometimes it's nice to be able to sit down with an actual book and sit there and study the page in detail and see all of the different levels of the armor. If you don't have a nice museum near you that has some of these kinds of pieces in it. So we got a couple of color plates in here showing you illustrations of what the armor looks like and, you know, some of the outfits. We got the... Let's see if I can turn this sideways. All right, so those pieces. Those. Yep. yep. So I really like the illustrations. They help me quite a lot when I'm doing art projects or writing projects to be able to describe things differently or to illustrate them. Let's see the next one. Oh, the next ones are back to normal interface and I just find these kinds of outfits so pretty and appealing. You know, and then when you watch movies that involve these time periods then you get a sense of how the pieces were put together and what the meaning of the different pieces are. So I love these kinds of pictures that show you the details of what's happening. and the illustrations that help you understand what the different pieces are. So on one hand, there are you know very expensive books out there that have a full color set of everything. On the other hand, this is a fairly inexpensive way to get a lot of this information, and there are pictures in here that you won't find anywhere else, so it's good to have to fill out a collection. So I enjoy this book very much. Let me know if you have any questions about it.